Hello, welcome to my channel. I'm Melissa, Lane and Hobby Farm. So today we went to Myers. Um, we took a tractor ride and I'll put a little clip of that in before I do the grocery haul. But we did groceries today. Um, we didn't need a whole lot, but somehow we still managed to spend $250. So there's that. And then we got outside and we realized we forgot to buy the RV pink stuff, the marina. I don't remember. The stuff you put in like when you're winterizing your camper. So we live in Michigan, we got to winterize because, you know, pipes freeze and bust and nobody wants that mess with a new camper. So we're going to do that. So we, like I said, we spent 258 in here. We had like $20 worth of coupons. So it didn't make much of a difference, made a difference. But um, we went to a pet store and we have, we have snakes and we don't feed live snakes anymore because most of the pet stores here in Michigan don't sell live mice for humane reasons um they think feeder mice are inhumane um so it is what it is but i stopped into this one i was like hey let's grab some frozen pinkies for one of our smaller snakes and see if they got some bigger ones because sometimes they do um for our black snake center and they had live so we got one live we haven't fed live in a very long time um typically i would have bought four um, two per snake, but because we haven't bought live in a while and the snakes haven't had live, I only bought one live one for the bigger snake. I'm gonna see how he does, if he does well with it. I also got him a frozen because he does eat two of the small mice. Um, he probably could move up to like baby rats, but we just have not. We just continue to feed him what he eats. It keeps him alive, it keeps him healthy, so it's what we stick to. Um, I do know the frozen mice are usually better um, they're tested for diseases and things like that. But when I buy from a pet store, I kind of expect them to be disease free. So we'll see, hopefully. I've never had a problem with live mice before, but I've also never bought from this pet store. So we'll find out. Um, so I will give you a warning because I will put a small clip in here of putting the snake in the cage. So I'll give you that warning now. Whether the snake eats the mouse or not, I don't know. We'll see how that works out. Um, I've Years ago, we had big snake um, when I was a kid and we put snake, a mouse in there and it didn't need it. It ended up just kind of living in the cage with the snake for a long time. And then we took it out and gave it its own cage and it turned into one of those great big white with brown spot rats. We had that thing forever. But um, after that, he did eat all the other. So maybe it was just something special about that one. <laughs> I've always wondered if that'll happen again. Probably not, but we'll see. Anyways, so we will get into, first I'll show the video of us on the tractor. It's just a small little clip going down the road. And then uh, we'll get into that grocery haul. So. Okay. <laughs> Seventy-five. You get almost twenty dollars in coupons. So, so two fifty-eight is what we ended up paying. But we got some of these pretzel things just to put in lunches for snacks. We got two pounds of not the ham that we usually get, but we found a different kind. So we got two pounds of that. We got a thing of the tomatoes. This will be picking those up later. We got five. Um, bulbs of garlic. I'm going to do the garlic, honey, and ginger for cold and flu season. None of us are sick right now, so we are, but we're going to, uh, I'm going to make this today so it can sit for the next month and then have it if we get sick. Hopefully it won't. I got two things of sub buns for lunch meat, or for lunch. Got two loaves of bread. These were, um, two for eight. Uh, they're normally like six dollars a bag, so we got these ones that are just the red, and then we got 
at the Dynamic Duo, and they only had one bag of those. I actually wanted two bags of those ones, but they didn't have two bags. I got one of one apple thing for me. I love apples, but I got one squash. I actually got this um, at a at a Cotant, not at Myers. It's just here because I bought it, and so it's part of what we'll be eating. I got a rotisserie chicken. It's warm. I'm going to let it cool down, and uh, then I'm going to shred it up, and we're going to do chicken pot pies out of it later on in the week, but I want to get it peeled and put in the fridge, like shredded up and put in the fridge. So one of my sons is starting a new job, and he's going to be working outside, and so I got these. They were two pairs for $19.99, so I'm really hoping that they work, but they are super, super thick, so I told him, like, um, wear them under your regular or wear them over your regular socks that way you can wear them for like two different days unless your feet get sweaty and then in which case you know, one one time and I'll wash them um, or also he needs to know not to dry these these when I could dry they will get hung dry hung up in the basement I got cosmic brownies those are for lunches fudge rounds or Logan snacks um, I buy these for our chicken pot pies. They're just very convenient. I'm not very good at making them cross. So. I get a thing of vanilla oat milk. I want some cereal. Regular milk. I don't drink regular milk like everyone else. And so this is something I'm going to try. We'll see how it is. But I guess some, I wanted some Raisin Bran Crunch. So that's what I got for cereal for me. And then I'm going to try this with it. I get a thing of Hawaiian Punch. Orange. Two coffees. Um... I haven't been drinking as much lately, so I just got two instead of three. I got four of these because they were instead of like a dollar thirty something, they were a dollar. So I thought I'd get them just for snacks. So this is something new. I'm gonna try it. It says it makes 21 12 ounce drinks. Uh, so we're gonna see if I like it, and hopefully I will. If I don't like it, I'll still drink it because I like tea, but I won't buy it again if it's not like great concentrate. Um. Aaron wanted this cereal. He likes this. He says he's going to add some sugar to it. And then I got a thing of Cheez-Its. And then these noodles. I haven't seen noodles for a dollar or less in a long time. Um, they're thick. So we've never really bought the thick spaghetti, but we'll see. And they looked like this big box. Like this is like my finger. So this is a good size box. It's half full. But I still got five of them just because a regular box of generic or regular noodles are like a dollar thirty to a dollar seventy and these ones were only a dollar so I grabbed them. I got applesauce cinnamon. I like these. These are good little snacks. There's a lot of sugar in them but I like them anyways. Um thing of ranch because we were out and this is over seven dollars now for this big bottle. Ridiculous. I got the Sun Bakery Sunbelt Bakery um chocolate chips we do buy the chewy granola ones um but one of my sons he prefers this brand this is his favorite brand and so since he's going to be traveling a lot with his work i got him two boxes that he'll just be able to put them in his truck and be able to just have them in there i got two things of provolone cheese for snacks i got six all the same kind this time just because it's been tasted this one's been tasting better than the other one so i just got six of these I got two things of cottage cheese, um, two big bags of mozzarella. We're going to make um, lasagna. And I don't use ricotta cheese. I use lasagna. I use cottage cheese. I like the cottage cheese better. And then I got, these were on sale, uh, four for five. And so I got the butter, two butter and herb. And I got two chicken. And then for Andrew's lunches, he wanted creamily creamily <laughs> creamy broccoli and cheddar so we found this one here and I got this one and then this is loaded potato uh, I think this one my husband wanted and then we found these ones with the broccoli cheese and they have crackers on them and since he'll be working on the go you won't really have a lunch room or anything to warm it up with this will be what he's gonna get a couple of those so we picked him up uh, four soups. He won't eat soup every day, but he'll eat them for, you know, maybe twice during the week and then some subs and stuff. So, and then this one as well. And then I picked this one up for myself. It just sounded good. Sweet corn poblanos. So, and then I got four cans of SpaghettiOs. 
and then bury that soup first because I'll just drop it on the ground. But I got three cases of Mountain Dew, a case of Coke, Cherry Coke, and then a case of Monster for, you know, traveling, keeping him awake. He's going to be driving like an hour and a half just to get to work, and then he'll be working 12 to 14 hour days. So we're going to supply him with all of the energy that he needs. <laughs> so this is, this is all we got. 258. This is it. Just this little bit.